okay, using wolf face paint, I will start painting my whole face. I know. I will also be doing three layers of this just so my face could be extremely, extremely white. Now using black wolf face paint, I will start doing diagonal lines across my face. I'll try avoiding the eye area since we are going to paint that black later. Once you're all done and your face looks like that, you're going to start doing the opposite direction. Same thing, diagonal lines, but you know, the opposite direction. It doesn't matter if they're messy, we are going to fix them and color them in later on. So now we're going to do the eye socket, we are going to paint the whole thing black in the inside. Just like that. You should end up with something like this. Then I will create a nose and fill it in with black face paint. I am doing a triangle one since we are doing a skull. This is actually something you should have done first before doing that diagonal lines. I am actually creating the jawline. But I decided to do this last, so I don't know if you could really see it. Hopefully you can. But yeah, that's basically what I am doing. I am creating the jawline. And then I will be filling it in with white face paint. After this, I will be painting my lips white. This is basically going to be the base for the teeth. I will go over the jawline once again with white to make it more brighter. I'll also go over the mouth area with white again. From here, I'm just going to create the face shape of the skull with black face paint. This will give the illusion of having a more thinner face, more sucked in, kind of how skulls have it. Using cream black face paint and an angled brush, I will start going through the jawline and I will be fading it in. just so it gives a more, a bigger illusion. I will then start drawing the mouth and the teeth. I will be doing little squares. They don't have to be perfect. It is a skull either way. A pretty old skull. Now using my Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade, I will start creating the eyebrow in the center. I will be feathering out the middle section of it because I do want them to appear bushy and similar to Frida Kahlo's eyebrows. Also, I will be making them darker than what they were already. Using wolf face paint again, I will start coloring in the squares in my face. The colors I will be using are yellow, red, blue, and green. Try not putting the same colors together. Mix them around your face. And go crazy with it. Add glitter, add anything you want. I kind of just wanted more of a painted look. I'll be going over little details like my neck and my teeth afterwards and then you're done. Todos 
me dicen el negro llorona, el negro pero cariñoso. Todos me dicen el negro llorona, el negro pero cariñoso. 